Many of our non-Catholic brethren will give Catholics a hard time for praying formal prayers such as the Hail Mary. So let's break down that prayer today. When we look at the first half of the Hail Mary, they are taken directly from Scripture, the Gospel of Luke. But more than that, they are the very words of God himself. The angel Gabriel proclaimed to Mary, Hail, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Again, these are not the words of Gabriel himself, but the words that God gave to Gabriel to proclaim to Mary. So we're proclaiming the very words of God there. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. These are not just the words of Elizabeth, but it says in the scriptures that Elizabeth was filled with the Holy Spirit, and she makes that proclamation. So these, again, the words of the third person of the Most Holy Trinity, making this proclamation through Elizabeth. And so when we say the Hail Mary, not only are we referencing the Word of God, the Scriptures, but we are referencing the very words of God. And so when we say that Scripture and the Word of God has power, how much more power does the Hail Mary have? Because they are the very words of God. It's a powerful prayer. Don't miss the opportunity, especially you non-Catholics. It's easy to learn.